top of the morning to ya. Oh, wait, I should pose in front of my green screen. Because it's St. Patrick's Day. I haven't said hi yet today. I did film a little dream summary this morning, and then I just sat down to... I don't know what. Uh, I've been going through emails, doing some copywriting. I've got a Zoom call for a charity thing at 7. Uh... And I've got less than an hour. I haven't gone for a jog yet. I want to go for a little walk, though. Apparently it was warm out today, so I'll do that. I uh, hope you guys are doing well. Just wanted to say hi and have, you know, make sure there's a story every day, because then Facebook can tell me, this is what you did last year, and it's a way of going, oh, that's where I was. <sighs> Hello. Hello. My name is Josh. You might think this is one of those filters that makes your face look weird, but no, this is actually just my face. It's my face. Hello. I'm basically a thumb. Here's my brother. Mm, see? We're, like, basically twins. <laughs> what am I doing? Okay. I should be going to bed. Here's the thing. Um, right now I've been sitting on the couch. I guess around 9 o'clock I was like, I should go to bed. And then somehow I've been sitting there for half an hour. And then the big debate was, do I just take the chance and try sleeping on the couch? Right there? Or do I... Uh, go right into the garage right now. Probably what's going to happen is I'll try the couch again, and then at 5 in the morning I'll go to the garage. Uh, <laughs> ridiculous life I live. Uh, somebody asked me, uh, messaged me and said, why is the woman messaged and asked, why is the garage more peaceful than the couch? That's not the situation. It's not that it's more peaceful. It's that uh, my dad has the thermostat on too hot at night. And I just keep waking up in the middle of the night covered in sweat. And so the garage is cooler. So I'm just wondering, do I just go there now? Ugh, I don't know. It's just such a pain in the butt to drag everything out there. It's nice and cool, though. Let's see, well, I'm, I'm trying to think positively. I'm like, you know what? It's like I'm camping. It's like I'm outside. and It's, I don't know. Anyways, what did I do tonight? I did a Zoom call. Um, I was just here working on my computer, I guess. And then... Uh, and then my dad's like, we're eating at 6. So I went up and ate. And then I had 7 o'clock a Zoom call um, for this charity that I'm on the board of now, part of my old university. And I was worried that it would make me so nostalgic, like so, oh my God, because the, the president of the board is a professor there. And I'm like, oh my God, I want to be a politics professor, inviting my students to be on the board. Uh, it's an interesting age range, because there's one guy who went to Glendon, I think he started in 1965, so that would make him, I don't know, like 24, year, 24 years older than me. Basically a bit younger than my dad, I guess. But he, you know, he's an older guy, I guess, older than me. And then I'm sort of in the middle, but I'm still an old guy compared to these kids who were born when I was 30. Um, so yeah, it's all, it's all interesting. Uh, but it actually made me feel good because it kind of makes it human. It's like, okay, I can see the students, I can see the professor no matter what, we're all sort of just sitting here right at this moment on this Zoom call. So at that moment, for those two hours, I'm not missing anything. It's like not if I was still in school, would I be still living there? And then i like, what is, what do I want? Do I want to be sitting on campus? Like, What is it exactly that I feel like I'm I'm missing? Like, of course, I wish I was 18 years old again and in the residence, surrounded by girls and all of that. But... I mean, even 18-year-olds, I mean, like, that one year is, that one year, and then it goes by, like, time moves. I mean, I can't do anything. Of course, I'd like to freeze myself in time, but nobody's able to do that. So you just got to enjoy what you have, I guess. Um, just got to keep giving my brain stuff to do so that it doesn't, you know, per perseverate, whatever the word is, over this stuff. Anyway, so it was a nice Zoom call, and... Uh, you know, I was talking about actually one guy who just is a recent graduate. He's like, Josh, I, uh, by the way, I Googled you. Um, hope you don't mind. Well, we're on the board, so whatever. And yeah, it seems like you're really in into like, uh, you know, communications and comedy and music and all of that. And so maybe you could get like some singer, like some big names to join our, you know, charity fundraiser. I'm like, oh, maybe. And I'm banned from, uh, messaging on Facebook for a little bit because what I did was I decided when I was sitting in the food court yesterday to post a couple of hellos in some Facebook dating groups for various 
uh, different countries, and apparently those were super popular. Like, I would be very, very large in certain countries, and they were getting, like, thousands of likes and comments. And so I was trying to message people back, but I messaged too many people back, and Facebook thought I was spamming. So, um, whatever. Uh, so... Uh, that's why if, if you're trying to message me on Facebook, um, message me on Instagram and I can message back from there for now. Or I guess, I don't know, message me your phone number and I'll add you to WhatsApp. I'm not sure what the best solution here is. What do celebrities do? Well, I guess celebrities don't sit there messaging back thousands of people. They just live their lives and let the, let the masses adore them from afar. So what can I focus on tomorrow? I think I need to focus on making money. I sometimes want to be like uh, Kevin O'Leary on Shark Tank, just being like, I'm not doing anything without making money. I want to make money. I love money. But he's also got a wife. He married his wife early on, and he's got kids and everything, so it's like he's got that covered off. So he can be little. He can be money man, because he's got his family. But what can I do? I don't know. I just... Whatever. Um, oh yeah, a lot of people have been messaging. They wanted morning check-ins today, and I didn't do it, so... Hopefully I'll go to bed now and get up early and we'll do a morning check-in. Maybe somebody wants it at 10 a.m. I'll, I'll see what people want to do, but I, I want to be there for you guys. I want to have you uh, talk to me in the morning and we'll all be encouraging each other for the day because, you know, maybe you're like me and you don't have somebody to roll over and say hi. Or maybe you do have somebody to roll over and say hi to and you're like, mm, I don't really want to be talking to you. I'd rather check in with Josh. So let me think. What's a good question? Have I answered... Did I share the answer for the questions of the day from yesterday yet? Okay, Going Boldly says, I wake up a couple of times a night frequently. Yes, tired in the morning after those nights. Well, uh, I've read that the history shows, you know, well, scientific studies and also history shows that people are supposed to wake up at least once in the middle of the night. And they have first sleep and then second sleep. So it's normal. So it's of color. 85% I sleep through. I may wake up for a pee. I usually go to bed at midnight and up at 8 a.m. Not tired. Wow, I wish I could go to bed at midnight and wake up at 8 and not be tired. I'm always tired. Huh. But, uh, well, I'm glad you're peeing. Kiki says, I keep waking up and sleeping again. I'm tired in the morning because I'm more of a night owl. Yeah, I'm a night owl too, I think. But I want to be a morning person. But I guess you got to work with what you got. But also important sleep hygiene, I guess. Like get off the phone early and stuff. Well, for a question, since it's St. Patrick's Day, I'd like to know what you guys did for St. Patrick's Day. I'd also like to know, do you still go to bars? Like, depending on what age you are, you probably don't, or maybe you do. I used to go all the time. I loved it so much, but now I don't. I mean, obviously I can't. I mean, I guess I could. I don't